Hello students. Welcome back to your English class. I am Mrs. Jenny Shah, your English teacher. Yesterday we just completed the poem A House a Home by Lauren M. Holly. Now, do you agree with the poet? Do you agree with what the poet says? All right. I would love to listen to your opinions. But as of now, I just want you all to write down in your notebooks a yes or a no. Now, in the poem, A House and a Home by Loren M. Holly, the poet has addressed a very important issue about how a house and a home, which although are synonyms for each other, actually mean very different things. A house is just brick and stone, whereas a home is love and family. So students, now we need to come and analyze this. So open your textbooks to page number 16. These things you're going to do in the textbook itself. First question is, do you agree with what the poet says? Do you agree? All right. A house is made of, what will you write over there? Brick and stone. What does it have? It has eaves and chimneys and tile floors. Okay. So the first answer will be a house is made up of wood, stone, brick, wood and stone. It has eaves, chimneys and tile floors. You can add stucco, roof or doors also. A home is made by. Now we come to the second paragraph. This answer is here. A home is made by love, family, unselfish acts, kindness, care. And what does it have? It has mother, father, brother and sister. Okay, I hope you have written this in your note textbook students. I'm repeating a house is made of brick, stone, wood. It has eaves, chimneys, tile floors, stucco, roof and lots of doors. You can write any three of these. Then a home is made by love, care, kindness, unselfish acts. It has family, brother, sister, mother and father, etc. Okay, next is, now complete the sentences about your house and home. My house is, what is your house? Write down what you think your house is. And the next line is, the best thing about my home is, so write down something best about your home over there. So what I want you to do, students, is in your notebooks, I want you all to draw two images on the same page. You will divide the page into two parts. Write the name of the poem on the top, A House, A Home, by Loren M. Holly. And then you will do two drawings. One is of a house and one is of a home. I have some images to show you for the same. Shouldn't this is an image of a house? You can draw any image of these or one of your own. It's absolutely fine. And I want one image of a home where you show your family with it. Okay. It can be in any form. Like you can see, you can have it in this without the faces drawn or like this with the faces drawn or like this however you want okay this is your drawing homework and on the next page students there are some questions that i have i had asked you all last time to write one word that comes to your mind when i say home that had to be done in the textbook now in the notebook i want you all to answer these questions where would you like to live a house or a home and why Okay, give one reason to your answer of why you would like to live in a house or why would you live, like to live in a home, which is your option. What have you selected? Next question, 
name any one essential element of a home what do you think is the most essential element of a home okay and students don't do this third one it has been done in your textbooks you don't need to do it again just two questions for this chapter please complete the homework and keep i will ask you all in any of the zoom classes to read it out and i don't want to hear you've not done it okay with this we end this class students stay home stay safe take care keep learning thank you